Cause you're my happy holiday If you want to start your journey in making blogs, videos for YouTube, Instagram, TikTok or any other platform, then this is a great addition for your filming kit. And if you are searching for some gift for your friends, for your vlogging friends for these holidays, so you might consider watching this video till the end. Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on my channel. A few weeks ago PGY Tech has released their new version from the Mantis Pod. It's the Mantis Pod 2.0, it's a mini tripod and it comes in three different versions. Let's talk about them. By the way, if you are new to this channel and you are interested in vlogging gears and camera tech reviews and videos, you might find what you like on this channel. So I highly recommend if you subscribe to my channel and if you hit like on my videos, that's a must have for me. Let's go back to the video. So as I said before, this mini tripod comes in three versions. The basic one, about 60 euros. It doesn't have a ball head on top of it. You have only a quarter inch screw so you can put your camera on and you don't have the capability of the panoramic view and the ball head capabilities on the tripod. Uh, the second version comes with the ball head without a remote control and this version costs about 8 euros. And the third one comes with the remote control for about 100 euros. The remote control can control lots of cameras such as uh, many Sony cameras, many Canon cameras and GoPros, but I don't feel like using the remote control a lot so I didn't get the third version. I got only the second one which is cheaper which is uh, more useful for me because when I need to, uh, to reach the camera I use the application, the mobile application of the camera or even since it's a short tripod I can easily access the record button and the shutter button on top of it and I can access and start recording and stop recording easily without any problem. As a content creator I needed a small tripod that can fit easily in my backpack, a lightweight one for vlogging because I'm using the ZV-E10 or the Fujifilm X-T4 and I needed something uh, lightweight, small, compact and can fit easily in my backpack and can handle the weight of my camera with the microphone and the LED light maybe on top of it when I'm shooting in low light situations. I tried many tabletop tripods in the past from Manfrotto to Yolanzi to Hoham to the Insta360 selfie stick with the tabletop tripod to other brands they all have the same features, some of them can extend a little bit, some of them can go to very low angles, they are really nice, they all look probably the same. After a few months of using them, all felt a little bit loose, especially on the legs or the ball head, so I didn't like to use them much because I was risking my gear and my camera equipment when I'm using these kind of tripods. So I needed something different for this time, something that I don't worry if I'm putting my camera on top of it and carry it around all the day. So that's why I went to try the Mantis Pod 2.0 because first it's cheaper than the Mantis Pod Pro, the first version. And when the first version was released, it was too much expensive for me. And I was like hesitating to buy it, but it was really too expensive. So I decided to wait a little bit. And then this one is about half the price of the first version and it's a good deal so i highly recommend you to try this mini tripod if you don't have any uh, tabletop tripod or if you are searching for a tabletop tripod this is a very good one let's talk more about it just now it feels really premium it's not slippery it has like a good grip to it it's very nice to have it in the hand it's made from plastic but not the cheap plastic it's a very high quality plastic it looks very sturdy and very robust. I really like it. It has buttons and locks on the tripod in order to maintain firmly the position of the camera when it's on the tripod so you don't risk your gear to fall out and break your camera. Moreover, this mini tripod is announced to handle a payload of about two kilograms. By the way, the vlogging kit for 2022-2023, they are lightweight. They won't be uh, two kilograms, even with a microphone, with a big lens, or even with a LED light on top of it. By the way, I don't recommend you to use big, long and heavy lenses on top of your camera using this tripod, even if the total weight won't be two kilograms, but the front element of the camera and the rig will be front heavy and you risk that the camera and the rig will fall out and break your lenses. This tripod can go to very low angles for some b-roll shots. It's really handy when you are filming and you are doing some shots uh, other than vlogging. 
it's very nice to have. It can be used also in briefcase mode for some follow shots, for some follow footages. It's really nice to have it. It's not a stabilizer, so make sure that your camera is stabilized and you have a good stabilized lens also, that's a must. If you want to do some photo shots and some running shots with the briefcase mode and the camera. The main issue of this tripod is that it does not extend, so you cannot vlog with a farther distance so you need to have a wide angle lens on top of your camera in order to vlog correctly uh, so it does not have a central column you cannot extend it if you want to buy a mantis pod 2.0 you have to consider this issue on the on this tripod before buying it on the other hand you can use this tripod in vertical mode you only have to flip the ball head to the vertical position and fix your camera and make sure that the camera is stable on top of it you can use this mode for some shorts, reads for Instagram, or even some TikTok videos. It's really handy for some content creators. This strap inside the tripod can fit easily a phone holder that you can buy separately from the PGY Tech website. It's about 15 euros. It's really a clever thing that PGY Tech has included inside of this tripod. You can buy it separately, as I said before, but you can use now your phone to vlog and your camera if you need to. You can remove the ball head and then you have a quarter inch thread on top of this tripod it comes the basic version of this tripod that I talked about in the beginning of this video you can put any LED light any action camera or any other kind of cameras on top of this one without having any issues and it will be like any other tripod in the market by the way the ball head comes with a quick release Arca Swiss uh, kind of plate which is really nice you can put your camera directly on top and then you can secure it with this lock here and then the camera will not fall out even if you shake it like this it's a very sturdy quick release system and i really liked it by the way this base plate that comes with the mantis pod 2.0 is an arca swiss type so you can mount it on any tripod that you have basically all of the tripods nowadays are arca swiss compatible except some manfrotto tripods but mostly all of the other tripods are arca swiss and PGY Tech made something really clever because all of their products now they come with uh, such a thing, uh, such a nice uh, base plate. They are all compatible with Anarka Swiss and with some uh, quick release system from PGY Tech. That's why I bought some other uh, quick release plates so the camera can fit easily here and then you can mount it inside your car on, on other mounts. That's really a nice feature to have and it's really clever from PGY Tech to include this uh, feature inside of their products. The most genius thing on the PGY Tech Mantis Pod, the Pro version and the 2.0 version, is this piece of plastic that they included inside of the uh, tripod itself. So you can now put your tripod almost anywhere without worrying about it to fall out. Now I'm putting it on top of my uh, door, which is really a nice angle to have in my home studio here to have some headshots, to have some uh, vlogging shots directly from here without worrying about the camera to fall out. That's really nice to have. So as I said before, uh, now you can hang your camera almost anywhere that you like using this uh, Mantis Pod tripod. It's available on the Mantis Pod Pro, the first version, and the Mantis Pod 2.0. It's something really genius, as I said before. I'm really surprised of it. I was really afraid that the camera will fall out, but there is only one condition to respect. The front two legs of the tripod should not be floating, and that's it. By the way, I highly recommend you not to use heavy rigs on this uh, position of the tripod use only small cameras and lightweight rigs on the tripod when it's on this position it's more likely because i'm afraid that the front heavy element of the tripod the camera with the lens will be too much comparing to the piece of plastic on the back of this tripod itself but i hope that you won't have any problems with it because it looks really nice and you can achieve really nice angles that you couldn't achieve before using other tripods or other uh, tabletop tripods. Voila, that's it for today's video. I hope you liked it. I wanted to share with you my thoughts and my opinions about the PGY Tech Mantis Pod 2.0. I really liked it. I think it's a good addition to your kit if you are in filmmaking, in vlogging, in b-roll shots. That's a good addition. It might be also a good gift uh, for your vlogger friend for these holidays. I hope you enjoyed this video once again. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video. That's a massive help. And I see you on another one. Ciao.